What is up, everybody? D to the V here, and welcome, welcoming you back to the next episode of Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. In the last episode, we finished up Rico Harbor. This episode, we're gonna start the uh, next level in the game, known as Gelato Beach. And Gelato Beach, you know, I I really like this one too. But um, here we go. The um. The next, the first mission in the game is actually a, um, it's a floodless mission. Whoa, that was weird. I didn't even, oh god. No, I didn't mean to harm you, my friend. Why can't we be friends? What the, okay. Switch floods. Okay. So after that, that, um, that goes up and it's a sand castle. Guys, we made a sand castle. Oh God! I come in peace. Please don't make me into pieces. But into oh, ouch. And um, yeah. So today is being recorded on the twenty sixth, after Christmas. And for Christmas um, this year, I got a PS3 custom controller. Um, if you've heard of Scuff Gaming, they made it. Um, I got um, two customized shirts that I made. One says Dynamic Victini. It says Join the Movement, hashtag Victini Takeover. And it also has another one for my uh, collab channel known as Gamers Got Swag. And um, yeah, so if you actually want to check out Gamers Got Swag, I advise going there. Because they got some um, verses there that um, you might like. I'm doing one right now, actually, of. Uh, of um, uh, when Ocarina of Time and Kirby's Return to Dreamland, uh, with Libero Star and Game Row Nine. Ocarina of Time is with Game Row Nine. If um, just to avoid any confusion, um, and yeah. Also for Christmas, I also got five hundred dollars with cash, uh, fifty dollars with a um, a PSN card for PlayStation Network, which uh, I actually used to buy the season pass for uh, Call of Duty Black Ops Two. Um, yeah, so, um, I'm gonna actually cut back to the, um, to the level. So, I will see you guys in a, uh, brief momento. Alright guys, we are back, and um, the uh, button's actually going to be a little bit later in level, but uh, it's right here. So basically, uh, let's get back onto the topic I was talking about for Christmas. Actually today, um, we went out to Walmart to buy my brother a TV, because he got a capture card, and he's going to start doing videos, because he's like, I want to be like Tyler and do videos like him, but I'm like, okay, but I'm not helping you, because I had to learn all by my own. So I think it would be uh, set if he had to learn by his uh, self as well. Or maybe I just like being a uh, douchebag to my brother. And I'm just a little Victini troll. But who cares? I mean, either way. He's learning, learning a lesson! Oh my god, I almost died there. Oh jeez. Okay. Skills. Skills. I got the skills that kill! Okay. There's the uh, red corner right there. And we are gonna get it just in time, in the nick of time, ladies and gentlemen. Ten seconds to spare, and we got it, out of babe. But uh, yeah. So um, the the capture card my brother got, it's a capture card called Z Roxio, and the Roxio is a HD capture card, similar to the HD PVR, but not quite as good in my opinion. I prefer the HD PVR, in all honesty, and um. Here's the thing, we have to do the same thing with the PVR than what we actually had to do with uh, the same thing he has to do with his Roxio. It seems his Roxio was missing some um, cables, actually component cables through his Xbox 360. So he's going to unfortunately have to uh, go out and buy some. And what I plan to do is um, um, I'm planning to get a new capture card as well. If you guys have heard of the Elgato game capture. Um, it's supposedly the best out of the market, and I plan to actually get one. 
I plan to sell my PVR actually to get it, but I'm gonna make sure that um, the Elgato is right for me before I actually sell it. Because if it's not, then um, something bad could happen. And, um, well, yeah, just like that. But it's, it's better to be prepared and have a plan instead of sell it. And, and um, hope, what if it didn't work? You'd be pretty screwed. Then uh, that wouldn't be good, would it? No, it wouldn't. It would actually be pretty awful. But, uh, yeah. So, it's being prepared. And basically, here's what you have to do this mission. You have to get all of these red things. And, um, just get that, and, okay. No. Okay, one sec. I'm gonna have to cut, because somebody's, uh, at my door. So I will be right back in a short second. So, um, see you guys in a little bit. Alright, guys, I really have no idea how long I was gone for. Probably about 30 minutes. But, uh, I'm, I apologize now. I'm back. And, um, we're gonna finish up we're gonna finish recording our this world and we'll be good so here we go we are on uh, ow that was kind of stupid to me I could have planned out a bit better and first off you're gonna get over there you're gonna get over there and then you're gonna okay one of them can go but you can just die okay guys so since we're just kind of you know we're just doing this Next, um, on the list of topics is Z. Well, basically, hmm, what am I trying to think? Oh, yeah. Um, so basically, uh, earlier tonight, I was, uh, playing Mario Kart with some friends, and then I got a call, and it was a call to, for a work job, right? And, of course, me, because I love money, I took it. And I completely just failed that. Good job, Tyler. But, um,. I took the job, and it's a four-day hockey tournament. Hey, you get back over there, ugly. Hey. You... You get back. 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 And I'm... I missed! Wow! That was fiend to the max! That was so gay. Okay, I'm gonna go over there. Okay, so now we gotta do this. I'm sorry, I'm being really silent. That was kind of stupid to me. But, um, that, I can't believe I missed that. I was so dumb. I had them all. They were all there. And I just, I, I goofed. And uh, also today, um, oh, they all went. But uh, today started the um, IIHF. Um, World Hockey Canadian for er, the juniors and today Canada played Germany and um, their game was actually at uh, 4 o'clock um, a.m. in the morning but um, they won 9-3 so good job guys way, way to rep the Canadians and uh, beat those Germans um, also uh, I'm sorry, I'm really cut for topics. I'm a little bit buzzed right now because I've been kind of doing a little bit of drinking tonight. Yes, I know I'm only 16. Please don't kill me. But I've been doing a tad bit of drinking. I'm sorry, guys. But, I mean, that's that. Okay, so right now I'm actually going to do a, uh, show you guys a secret shine. And, um, yeah. So if you see, um, oh yeah, if you see that ship right there, that's going to trigger a cutscene. But we're going to actually see that cutscene when we're actually done. This, um, you see, uh, I don't even know, I'm talking really stupid. But episode 3, Wiggler Ahoy. I guess actually we'll do this one, then I'll show you guys the secret shine. And, um, it'll be good. I think I may, I don't know if I'll do it all. Tonight? Okay, what's wrong with me? Okay, we're gonna hit this one! Boom! Did you get it? Yeah. Okay, so basically what I wanna do is get him on his tummy. Then, ground pound him. Remember, you can only use this leaf once, or uh, twice, before you have to go to another leaf. That would be the leaf in the center right there. So, make sure to... Just get it ready. This one! Did it work? Ow. One, two, three. Okay. 
so get up just keep going just keep going oh yeah so about the about the work yeah I'm gonna be working a shitload of hours I'm gonna be working at least I don't know what's it gonna be like 37 38 hours in just four days and that's almost two full days of working that's nuts but uh, that's how long I'm gonna be working it's gonna be really crazy so I really I'm gonna I may not be uploading as much in that weekend in those uh, span of four days um, as I normally would sorry but that's just how it's gotta be but nonetheless oh we did get okay I thought it was like gonna be down the water where I couldn't even touch him but uh, nonetheless that is the next shine in the game hell yeah and I'm getting messages up the ass tonight like people just love me they just keep messaging me I already have I have eight right now I had nine just a little while ago so I don't even know what's going on who's talking to me this guy um, a market weekland Ellie uh, the ocean OPZ and another guy from a clan that I'm in so as you can see I am I'm quite popular tonight it seems that everybody doesn't need me I'm they always whenever I'm actually on Skype people don't need me but whenever let's say I'm on Skype nobody needs me what the balls is that crap but oh well you know And as you know, my brother got his capture card known as Xeroxia. And, um, he also got a new TV. Which was a... Which was, like, super fiend to the max. And, yeah, basically. Uh, he got a new TV. But I also got two new games, too. I, I got Dead Island and Far Cry 3. And it was amazing. But I'm gonna show you guys the secret shine. Just, uh, spray that. Spray this! And there we go. We got it. Cool. And there it is up there. And there, that is your secret sh Another secret shine on this level. That's what it does instead of um, another floodless mission. I think. Ugh. The one thing I'm not going to be too excited for is the 100 coin mission. Because that took me forever to do on this one. Nonetheless, that's number 25. And shine it! Now, I'm at a, I'm at a really loss for topics right now. But, um, I'm gonna try and keep this as entertaining as possible. I have really no idea what to talk about. Um, well, actually, let's, let's go. I think the next mission we're doing is the same bird is born. If I am correct, the Mondo. And actually, speaking of Mondo, um, I used to have this character when I played, uh, Final Fantasy Tactics Advance on the Game Boy. By the way, I never beat that game because it's bullshit. But, um, yeah, I really don't like that game. It's too hard but um i had a character named mondo and i just thought that name was so cool so i used it for everything um in elementary school i had um my f uh, a friend uh, uh i used to like spend every recess with he doesn't live in um my town anymore <coughs> but he um we we did this thing where we played um we played like our own little live action role type of playing game in um at my school and we call it, we just call it the game because we didn't have an official name for it but um my screenplay name was mondo just and um it was actually inspired by him by um that character just because i loved the name so much so i decided to use it oh god oh god that was just, that was almost that was really close i thought that would have been the death of me but, um, basically what I like to do is I like to go for the tail one first, because that's always the hardest one. Um, that's basically my tactic in this. Okay, you just make sure to do a little mini jump, get this one, and, um, yeah. Um, also for, now that we mention it, um, a couple other, um, stories I could tell, or, um, just, um, something I was looking at. I remember when I was actually looking for, like, a new video! Ah! I'll be right back. Ugh. 
Alright guys, so, like what I was saying before, until I got really interrupted by the freaking Sandbird douchebag. Basically, what I was, I was looking for a game a little while ago, and, um, I saw a whole bunch of games in these $10 bins, and they were a lot of Wii games, but they were based off TV shows. And I saw this, I saw a game, it's called the, um, The Deadliest Warrior, and basically The Deadliest Warrior is a show where they, um, they take two different, like, um, people, let's say, like, ninjas versus, um, pirates, okay? They would take a pirate's expert and a ninja's expert, and they would, okay, well, I almost, I almost forgot about that, okay, jeez, I almost forgot, okay, but they would take one of each, and then they would have to do certain tests to prove how strong they are in each, and... Um, what that means is that they would, um, after all these tests, they would, um, take the tests and put them into a, um, 